Whose birthday is it? Is it your birthday? Oh, who's that for? <laughs> is it for birthday boy? Yeah. Hey, for the three year old. <laughs> is that for you? Look. Look at this. Is that for you? Yeah. Let's see. Goodbye. <laughs> Come on then. He's over me. Yes. <laughs> What's new, Alfie? What's this? Look. What's that? Look. Happy birthday to a special little boy. That's you. Come on. There you go, Lily. Oh, please. What's in here? What's this? Look. Oh, sorry, Lily. What do you think this could be? Can you smell it? Can you smell it? Look then. I'm so excited. Look. <gasps> Cottage pie. Yeah. Cottage pie. Is that for Lily too? I'm going to share. What's in here? What's in here? I think you can smell this one. Can you smell it? You pull it off. Pull that off. Come inside to you. Pull it off. Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh. What's that? What's that? Yeah! <laughs> A new toy! <laughs> Do you like him? It's a hippopotamus. Should we take his tags off? Okay, you can have him now. Lily, where's he gone? What do you think? You're going to share these? Yeah, you're going to share them. What is it, Cocker? What sort? Mm. Are you sad because it's not your birthday? It's okay, you can share everything. Lily, do you want a chicken treat? What do you do for a chicken treat? What do you do? <gasps> Clever girl! Okay, let's get one. Chicken treats. Come on. Goodbye. Okay, sit down. Sit down then. Sit. No, you're excited. Good boy, good girl. Oh, well, that went quick. Isn't it? You come up. Yay! Good boy, good girl. Hi, everyone. Today is Friday and it's also little Alfie's birthday. So my little tiny Alfie is three today. Where is the time going? I just can't believe he's three, but he's still a baby. He's still a baby. So because I vlogged Lily's birthday, I thought I would also vlog Alfie's birthday too. But I'm not really up to much today, so it's not going to be that exciting. I'm actually waiting on a delivery that I am quite excited about for a beauty box that I'm trying. It's a brand new beauty box. It's called Glitter Box. So I'm waiting for that to arrive and then I'm going to do an unboxing and sort of first impressions video on it. But I've just done my makeup and I'm just having a coffee and going through some emails and replying to people, playing catch up. And yeah, that's about it. Nothing exciting. <laughs>
I don't know if any of you have heard about this candle that they've got in at Aldi at the moment. It's called number two and it's fragranced blackberry and the fragrance is blackberry bay and it's meant to be an absolute dead ringer for the Jo Malone candle. I've never actually smelt the Jo Malone one in this scent so I can't really compare but a lot of people have said that it's just like an absolute dead ringer for it but I think this candle was about £3 or maybe £3.99 something like that as opposed to paying a lot more for the Jo Malone but it just looks really pretty it's really nice and stylish and it does smell nice it's quite soft though the scent is really soft it's not very um strong I would have perhaps liked it to be a little bit stronger but never mind it looks really nice and I also got some roses as well from Aldi which are really pretty Sometimes you can really drop on with the flowers at Aldi and they tend to last quite a long time as well if you get a good bunch. So yeah, they'll make a nice background. So, glitter box just arrived. Let me try and make it up. So this is what it looks like. Um, first impressions, it looks quite cheap. It just seems like a normal cardboard box. It's got like a little sticker on the front. Um, but let me just show you what's inside first. So you open the box up and you've got the nice tissue paper and a little card here telling you um, about the box and things and what's inside the box. So the idea is that you get like a, a full look in a box. So you'll get like makeup products and bits and pieces. So there's quite a few different ones in here. I'll just show you what there is. There's a Bella Pierre shimmer powder. I quite like the brand Bella Pierre. So that's quite nice. That's nice for summertime. Um, there's also a Bella Pierre super gloss in chocolate cream. I'll show you these colors in a minute so you can see what they're like. There is a um, bronzer and highlighter duo from Mana Kadar. Now, I've had this in a different beauty box previously and I was very shocked to see that this was full size. And look how tiny that is. You can see in comparison to my hand, it's very small and it's kind of hard to keep your brush just within one section, especially for a bronzer because you would expect to put a bronzer on with a larger brush all over your face. And you probably can't tell here, but these are um like very very shimmery so you don't really want to be using it as a sort of a contour shade that you'd use a smaller brush for so yeah it still baffles me that this is actually full size but it, that is correct it is definitely a full size product um next is sort of a multitasker pencil um who is this by actually saturated color multitasker pencil and the color is gingerbread so this can be used on the eyes or the lips it's quite a nice color it's a very soft pencil so you wouldn't be able to use it for brows and things like that um but you could probably use it as a coal liner and as a lip liner as well and then there's this really pretty nail polish from essie this one's called um getting groovy and it's like a, a golden color so that's quite pretty that'll look really nice for sort of like Christmassy um, time and things like that. So yeah, that's nice. The thing with this box is that, let me just check what it costs. So yeah, here it is, look. The box costs £15.95 per month for the glitter box. And then it says down here that delivery charges are like added when you put the shipping details in. So that won't be the total cost. There'll be more on top of that. So that's £15.95. And then when you look at, um, say like the Look Fantastic box, which is £15 and free delivery, the sort of standard of the box and the quality is much, much higher. So you get like a personalised box, not a personalised box, it's not the word I'm looking for. You get like a a different design of box every month that looks really pretty. Look how yellow everything looks there. It's a really strange colour. I'm having trouble with this vlogging camera. My nails don't look like that. Oh, that's better. So yeah, it's... I don't know. It just seems really cheap. I wouldn't... I wouldn't have subscribed to it if I'd have seen this sample first. So yeah, I still think out of all the boxes that I've tried that the Look Fantastic one is just much better value. I mean, just for the design of the box and things as well. The, the saving grace is that this is a very new company. This is only their second ever box, I believe. Um, so obviously there's time for them to grow and to make things better. 
Um, they've got a nice range of products for the second box. Essie is obviously a nice company. Bella Pierre is a well-known company. Monica Dar products can be quite expensive. Um, more on the higher end. I haven't heard of this one before. Um, but yeah, I'll do a, my review video anyway and see what people reckon. But yeah, I just don't know. I'm not so bothered. Tea break. It's been about maybe an hour and a half since I filmed my unboxing video and I'm just waiting for everything to finish downloading. So I'm just going to have a coffee. I'm going to have this. I don't mind these actually, they're not too bad. Our coffee machine broke and we didn't have one for weeks. And it was awful. So I'm a really big coffee drinker and so is my dad. So I bought these just to put me on until it was fixed. Anyway, it's sorted now, but I'm just gonna drink this. Anyway, do mum a cup of tea. I don't know about anybody else, but when I'm in the house and I'm on my own, because mum's in the studio at the minute and then she's coming back in. I always have to listen to something in the background and I really really like these um, horror channels so this is King Spook that I'm listening to at the moment and they basically just tell true scary stories that people submit to them and um, yeah they're like really interesting to listen to I really like listening to them I love things like that they're really spooky I thought I'd go a little bit brighter on my eyeshadow today. I wore an orange and pink one the other day for a festival look and I quite liked it. Don't usually wear so much colour but today I decided to go for orange and yellow so feeling a bit brighter. I did have some glitter on but I think it's... Mm, I've got a little bit on but most of it's come off. There's actually been a funeral on our street today and it's just a couple of doors down from where we live and it was somebody who we knew of. Um, he just suddenly died a couple of weeks ago, so it was his funeral today. Um, so we stood and watched and cried a little bit, so I think most of my glitter's come off, but yeah, it's so sad. When it's a really nice sunny day like today, it feels like, like nothing bad could ever happen, and then you see something like that. Oh, sorry, that's the washer. So yeah, as I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted. And it's such a nice day like this you don't think that anything is ever going to go wrong but it does sadly the people that we love aren't always going to be here so make the most of every day the so i'm still editing i'm just about finished now i'm just checking everything through before i save it and i've got my little editing buddy down here this is lily she's having a little snooze I don't know why but she always likes being sort of really squashed in at the side of you. She's always done this since she was a tiny puppy. She can have all that room there to sit there but no, she'd rather sit there. <laughs> She's so cute. Editing is finally done, the video is uploading so now I'm just waiting for dinner and then we're going to sing happy birthday to Alfie and then I'm going to end the vlog because I'm so so tired. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm just absolutely exhausted. So I'm sorry if it's not been very long or very interesting. I know it's not been very interesting but thanks for persevering if you're still here at the end. <laughs> so anyway I'll say goodbye to you all and hope that you've enjoyed the vlog and I'll see you all soon. Bye! Is it your birthday Alfie? Look! Is it your birthday? Got a little cake? Is that for you? Goodbye! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday dear Alfie! Happy birthday to you! Shall we blow your candle out? You blow it out! Yay! Don't go too near it! Goodbye! Are you looking forward to your cake? Are you Lily? Yeah!